Hey guys, it is day 23 of my Grown and Gather challenge. I've started today off by doing some editing of yesterday's video and getting ready to upload it to YouTube. But for breakfast, I have a nice big tangerine that I found yesterday out in the woods. And today I got some more bee work to do. I'm going to be um, gathering nucleus boxes to make splits next week and I need to um, get frames and clean some up and re-wax some foundation. So just some um, kind of not so exciting beekeeping work to do, but we'll see what happens and um, try to figure out what we're going to eat today. Better late than never. My chickens just laid two eggs. It's late morning, but I'm excited about this. I'm going to have a breakfast to fuel me up for the day, and then I got to go out and work on bee boxes. I just got home from working at one of my bee yards, cleaning up um, frames and getting nucleus boxes ready for splits. And I just cooked up some hog tenderloin that I had still in my refrigerators. Just um, seared it on the pan. So having a little lunch while I'm working on the computer here. It is good. Hey guys, it's day 24 of my Grow and Gather Challenge and I'm out here with my brothers. We're going to do a little fishing out in the Gulf of Mexico. Good job. Did you get him, Luca? Do you feel him wiggling? Is that like first of each? Yeah, yeah. 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 Crack the pen fish again. Oh, no, you just reel him right pen. into it. So you don't pen fish are hitting the net like. Oh, yeah. 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 You guys find someone to actually sell. They've been around for a while. Yeah, yeah they're popular. A lot of people do it every time they go out. Dang, man. We've been catching some fish. Some nice hogfish and some grunts. Here's one I just caught. Bring lighter, huh? Some of the <laughs> <laughs> some of the best eating fish in the ocean. Luca just had a big one and a bull shark ate it. Wish I had the camera for that. Can you do that again, Luca? <laughs> yep, just caught another hogfish. I haven't been on a hook one since I've been one that got the trim. They're biting good. Oh. Oh. Shark ate them. Shark got them. All right, I'm going to try to get one more. Come on, dude. You might get a bite. See if we can film this shark come up. I'm about to man. Oh. Is that baby shark? Let it go. See if I can get a minute. Go. Well, this was left of one. Hey, put it in the water. Put it in the water. Dang it. He was a keeper. Oh, you mother. You mother's brother. Hey, that works pretty good. <laughs> Got the old polarized. Your, uh, well, your filter. Yeah. Jake, well, I, heavy leader? that was a nice hog I wonder if this fish. would count as part of our limit, because we could make some fish head soup. <laughs> Man, that big old bull shark keeps getting us. They have to be 14. That one was a keeper. He ain't there no more. It's not my first time getting fish. Oh, the shark eats. That's a big old grunt. Yeah, I've, I've always caught hogfish in this spot. Yeah. Show them off. He's beautiful. <laughs> He's a gorgeous one. I just caught the biggest lizard fish in my life, and I'm gonna keep this guy and see what he tastes like. 
Never eaten one of these before. I just got home and we got a bunch of fish in this cooler. It is filled up with grunts and hogfish. So we're gonna have some good eating. We're gonna have some fried fish tonight. I am so excited right now. I got a bunch of hogfish all filleted up here. I got some beer batter. And I haven't eaten anything all day. It's about, I don't know, 540 or so. So I'm getting ready to demolish some of these hogfish. And this is some of the best fish in the ocean. It is just so white and clean and flaky. It is perfect. Got some fish frying up and there's the finished product right there. One of the things I filleted is that lizard fish and that's it right here. And it is full of bones. That's probably why people don't eat it too much, but I, I'm going to try it. I've never eaten a lizard fish. I don't know anyone that has. We're going to, looks like it is golden brown and ready. going to take it off and let it cool down a minute and see what that's like. So here is lizard fish. First time ever eating it. Whoop. I dropped it. Eh, not bad, not great. Has a ton of bones in it. So the reason people probably don't eat lizard fish is because it's too bony and it's not that great. <laughs> 